Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And someone uh, messaged me on Facebook this morning and wanted to know how they did this contour of these people's names, I'm guessing, and the date and everything. And so I, I thought I'd do a video on it. And I thought, you know what, I'm going to do a video on the, the, from the beginning process. I don't know what size the ornament needs to be, but I'm going to make it four inches. So I made my inner circle three and a half inches. I'm going to move it out of the way. I've got my nudge factor set on five inches, so it moves it out of the way. I'm going to bring in the circle, which is going to be the top. And you can kind of see it's going to say quadrant. That means it's right in the center. Take these two items and weld them together. Then you can bring in a small circle for the pin. Put P on your keyboard. And then hit T to get it kind of close. It's actually off the wood. But then you could just hold down your control button and move it down a little bit. Kind of make it equal. And then you can bring your inner circle back in with the nudge factor. So you've got that part done. I brought in a piece of clip art of a snowflake. And to save time on the video, and there's plenty of videos out there, and I have someone cleaning up clip art. This particular case, I didn't have to convert it to a bitmap. I went straight to Outline Trace, Clip Art, and it turned it into this. Now, as you can see, I have a white background. And then after you cleaned it up, you can always bring it in. And, and there's your, when you can see the yellow, that means that it's, it's transparent. There's nothing behind it. So, I'm going to stop the video right here and start on part two of installing that name. Hope that helped a little bit and thank you for watching.